Have crews are trying to clean up after the mess of this major crash right along I-65 uh, and Lakeshore Parkway. This 18-wheeler overturned on Lakeshore, blocking the westbound lanes for so many of you. So let's get right to our, our your reporter, Bria Chapman, live at the scene. What can you tell us? What are you seeing here, Bria? Yes, right here. So if you are traveling 65 southbound and you think you're going to turn right getting off that exit for, exit for Lakeshore Parkway, that will not be happening. I'm going to step out to show you all just how much traffic is here. As you can see, the roadway is still blocked here traveling Lakeshore Parkway westbound. If you get off, you are going to have to make a left turn and traffic is pretty heavy right now. Crews continue to clean up and like Jonathan mentioned, it was an overturned 18 wheeler. This all happened around 2 30 this afternoon and crews have been here since then. The 18 wheeler was carrying what you see right now, particle board, and that was all over Lakeshore Parkway. Crews from Wheel Wrecker are still here cleaning up, but we don't know how long this is going to take for everything to get cleaned up in these lanes to get reopened. But I did speak to one first responder who says, thankfully, there were no injuries, just a big mess. I don't know what caused the truck to overturn, but when he was making, he's coming off 65 southbound, making the turn onto Lakeshore westbound, and in that curve, he overturned, spilling a load of OSB plywood all over the lakeshore there. And that's what shut the interstate down. We had no injuries, no transports, uh, just a, a big mess to clean up. Yeah, and they ask that you avoid traveling Lakeshore Parkway westbound because as you can see, you really cannot do that. So, but the cleaning up will continue and we'll be sure to update you once this roadway reopens. Your reporter live tonight on Lakeshore Parkway. I'm Bria Chapman, WBRC 6 News on your side.